What's going on guys? Connor Thomas here from CoachConnorThomas.com Coming at you with my first YouTube video. So essentially what I'm going to be talking about today is what is my YouTube channel going to be about? Um, for those of you who know me, what's going on? Uh, for those of you who don't know me, I actually used to have an old YouTube channel um, and I'm kind of just doing my own thing now. So, uh, a little bit of background on me. I'm 20 years old. I'm from Ottawa, Ontario. Uh, that's in Canada. And I'm recently graduated from a two-year health and fitness diploma at Algonquin College. Um, so you're probably already thinking, okay, just another fitness YouTuber uh, who's probably just going to vlog his, his workouts kind of thing. And I mean, you're not wrong. That's definitely going to be some of my workouts. But I'm also just going to be doing like daily vlogs, uh, mindset vlogs, lifestyle uh, kind of things. And just talking to the camera and hoping that you guys can relate to me uh, by leaving some comments down below on what you guys want to see next and maybe um, some feedback. I always like some some uh, constructive criticism so I mean yeah always leave some comments down below um, telling me what you thought of the video uh, maybe what you want to see next and what you disliked and liked about the video because I always like to hear what people dislike so I can improve upon it next time. Um, so I'll give you some background in my fitness lifestyle and just kind of like um, what I what I do on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, so I started lifting when I was 16 years old. Um, before then, I never really uh, was interested in lifting. My father, um, he's actually been in the fitness industry his whole life. And so growing up, I always saw him like working out in the basement kind of thing. Uh, he used to work for some fitness companies. So I was always like, around that kind of kind of environment. Um, so it was kind of cool for me. So I started training at 16. Um, didn't really know what I was doing. Like I kind of just went to the gym, uh, just like any other person who's starting off in the in the industry, starting going to the gym. I didn't really know what I was doing. I kind of like trained back and arms and I love training in arms and I kept training in arms and then I realized I should probably do more than just arms in the gym. Um, and clearly it hasn't paid off. So, I mean, um, I, I then started competing in powerlifting, so I competed in three powerlifting meets. I uh, actually went to provincials one year in Hamilton uh, when I was 18 years old. Yeah, I believe about 17 or 18 years old. I went to provincials in Hamilton. I was super stoked about that. Got to Hamilton with an injury. Uh, wasn't sure if I was going to compete or not. Um, and that morning I actually felt really good when I was going to compete. I felt really good and then on my third attempt squat of like 474 I believe it was, um, I tore my vastus lateralis. It was a partial tear uh, but even since then I still haven't really regained the confidence to go heavy on squats. So um, I stopped powerlifting after three meets. Uh, my totals or my, my max PRs was a 600 pound deadlift. Max bench, um, my bench was always pretty, pretty uh, far behind my other lifts. Um, so I only had a 287 bench in competition, I believe, and then I eventually got a 305 bench outside of competition. Um, and then my max squat was 463, I believe, in competition, uh, which wasn't bad. I was 17 years old, uh, competing at 93 kilos, so I was competing at about, I was personally like 195 when I was competing. Since then, um, I was still studying health and fitness at Algonquin College which is also in Ottawa, and I decided to kind of take a whole twist. So went from competing in powerlifting to like eight months later, stepping on stage for my first physique show. Um, and since then, that was September of 2016. We're now May of 2017. I have yet to book a next competition, but I do plan on competing again, either in classic, classic physique or physique. Um, so I'm kind of just trying to grow this year. Um, I stepped on stage, I was 160 pounds. I'm currently 206.4. So I'm like 46 pounds over stage weight and I plan on continuing to grow to um, probably about 230 pounds. Uh, that's like my goal weight as an all natural athlete as well. Um, so I don't really plan on competing until 2018. So that's enough about my competitions. Uh, a little bit about me, I'm in love with my dog. <laughs> so you'll definitely be seeing him in some vlogs. I love my family, I, uh, I spend a lot of time with my family. I'm a huge advocate for self-love, uh, for respect for yourself, for peace for yourself, and also respect for others. 
Um, and that's kind of going to be like some of the topics that I talk about. I write blogs, I write poetry. Um, I'm into photography. I love photography. I'm not yet there yet, but I do plan on incorporating some photography into my day-to-day uh, -to -day things. Uh, I plan on upgrading my cameras and stuff like that. But for now, yeah, I'm just like your average guy. I work out of a private gym in Ottawa. It's called Love to Train. It's on Bank Street. Uh, we have a lot of fun there, so I'm one of their coaches there. And uh, yeah, we just have a lot of fun. And yeah, I just plan on continuing to to learn in this industry, continuing to inspire people in this industry, and continuing to educate people in this industry. Um, I love like the whole practical side of life, but I also love the whole like edu educational side of, uh, of what you do. So I'm very passionate about, about what I do. I'm very passionate about the fitness industry. Um, I'm very passionate about life and like giving my all into what I do. One of my hashtags is hashtag passion over everything. And just straight up, like, if you're not passionate about it, if you don't love what you do, people are going to see that you don't love what you do. And uh, that's going to rub off the wrong way. So I just hope you guys can see that I'm here. I love what I do. I'm here to inspire. I'm here to educate. Uh, but seriously, I'm, I'm really just here to be able to relate to people and to kind of tell you guys, I guess, my perspective on, on some topics. And so that's going to do it for this video. <clears throat> Check me out on Instagram at Coach Connor Thomas. I'll leave like a little clickable link right here. Um, check out my website, CoachConnorThomas.com. Um, not really active on Twitter. Um, if you guys want to check me out on Facebook, it's just Connor Thomas. So I'll leave all those links down below. And I'll see you in that next video. Much love.